Hey guys, today I just wanted to make a small video on how you can create a ballpoint pen brush inside of Photoshop. This is the kind of effect we are going for here. So you can see we have a very thin line with a little bit of feathering and this nice cross hatching overlay darkening going on, which is really suitable for this kind of effect. So the brush itself is actually very, very simple. We start from a round, simple round brush, we reduce the size down to 4 pixel, and then we just make it a little bit more of an ellipse, so reduce the roundness to about 50%. And then I have the spacing set to 1. In the shape dynamics, I literally just use the pen pressure to control the size, but make the minimum diameter to be 30%, so it doesn't get too small. Uh, otherwise it would get way too thin and it wouldn't look too good. So that's the only thing we do into shape dynamics. Then we have transfer. And for transfer, I only use flow and not opacity for this brush because I feel it's a little bit more natural. So let's set flow to pen pressure here. And then I have smoothing set to on. Don't forget that you also want to enable linear burn in the mode of the brush because if you have it to normal, it's still gonna work but it's gonna look a little bit different from what we had here, which is not too bad, you know, but I think it's part of the charm of this effect. So linear burn, and I also reduced the flow to 86%, just to slightly reduce the amount of ink that should flow. And this is pretty much it. You could tweak this further by adding noise uh, if you wanted to make it feel a little bit more pencily in a way as if the paper had more texture to it, which I think it's a, still a pretty nice effect um, if you like that. But yeah, this is the base of it. I'm gonna include the download link for this brush into the description so you can get it straight away. And as usual, if there's anything else you'd like me to cover or if you have any questions, please let me know in the comments. And with that, I'll see you next time.